Hello everyone, welcome back. Today we are doing little Lily's newborn pictures. I'm really excited because I have some ideas of pictures I want to take. So we're just pulling up to the photographer's house right now and we're gonna get these pictures taken. I'll see if I can get any footage of us doing them. I'm really hoping that she sleeps through this because they, she needs to like be asleep to be cooperative and hopefully she won't poop everywhere but knowing her she probably will because she likes to explode. She's sleeping right now. I feel like she'll probably wake up once we move her and then I'll have to feed her and then maybe she'll fall back to sleep. That's what we're doing. And then after this, I have a doctor's appointment to go to. You guys can hear me. Well, she can't talk. Of course she can. No, not yet. I talk to her every night. We're at the doctor's. We're here to do her two week doctor's appointment and we're meeting her pediatrician for the first time. I'm really, <laughs> Angry, I'm really excited to see how much she weighs because I feel like she's been eating so much and she looks like she's getting a little chubby. So. I'm excited to see how much she's grown in the last week because we were here exactly a week ago. It's just a wrap up film, right? Okay, yeah. So the last clip you guys saw was actually a few days ago because we're terrible at vlogging now because we're parents. <laughs> That's weird. But I know. We have little little Lily Bear in her crib right now. Happy, happy She's kind of hanging out while we're vlogging in here because this lighting, wow. Jonathan. The lighting's my fault. It Guys, is. don't blame her. Okay, so uh, we went to the doctors and everything is really good. They said that she is doing. This sucks. <laughs> Jonathan's trying to like be in the frame. <laughs> oh, that's so. Mm. So much better. That's I so you. good. Okay, so. Holla. The doctor said, did I say vet earlier again? I don't know. I can't stop saying vet when I talk about taking her to the doctor for some reason. <laughs> Every time I tell someone, I'm like, oh, we just took her to the vet. <laughs> I'm so used to just being a dog mom, it's weird. Okay, so, took her to the doctors. They said that she is looking great. She's already gained two pounds. So by now, probably by today, she's probably eight pounds. Um, and she was six one when she was born, so. And then she is doing great. Our first eating. appointment, she was like 5'10". And then two days yeah. later, she was like 100 pounds. She blew <laughs> up like a balloon. So she's doing really well with the breastfeeding and everything. And my boobs are doing a lot better. Like, I know last time oh. I told you guys that they were like blistered and hurt Shredded. really bad and everything. Because the first week, it's kind of brutal. Mm -hmm. um, they're completely healed now, so it doesn't hurt to breastfeed. It's just like normal now. So... There's an update for that. But yeah, so she's looking really good. We met our doctor, which we had talked about in the clip before this, and we actually really don't like him. So we're going to be switching and finding a new doctor. Yeah, he just didn't fit us. Yeah, he didn't give us like the vibe that we wanted, and we want to obviously feel comfortable. He's a new doctor in our area, so it's just, it was gonna be a questionable, but we, I feel like we could literally do this with four doctors in a row for all we know until we find one we like. So I know. So we have I think it's important though. We have to like, we have to be comfortable with it. Yeah. So we're just going to try out a few different, you know, ones. Hopefully the next one that we have an idea of who we want next. So hopefully that one will be the one. But um, yeah, so she is doing great. Her jaundice is gone which uh, I think last time we made a video she was still having some. I'm not sure. She still had I don't remember where when we did it. I don't know. It was very small. No. Yeah. So now she's she's two weeks old and two days, and um, yeah, we're still 
I'm feeling definitely more tired and sore this week than I was the first week. I feel like the first week is kind of just like, I don't know, the first couple days were hard, but then it was like really good and I felt great and everything. And then I started getting uncomfortable or sore and it's just like hurts down there. I had gone to the doctor this week to get everything checked out to make sure just because it was really uncomfortable to go to the bathroom. Mm. Number two specifically, it hurt really bad. So, <laughs> okay. I smell butter noodles. Did she poop? I have a feeling. But yeah, so everything's looking good for me too. I'm just sore, like today I'm really sore. Yeah, I feel like it's like a car accident, you know, like, you know, directly after you sometimes you feel okay and then randomly mm -hmm. a week and a half, two weeks later, you're just like, ow. Yeah, it just like comes in weird way of yeah. things, but Very random. yeah, getting getting used to her schedule and everything like that with feedings at night, definitely tired, I think that just like comes mm -hmm. with it, but still just so in love and so happy. This guy goes back to work though this week, so I will be alone and I'm really scared. You're gonna do good, Katie. But, You're gonna do great. Yeah, I think I think it'll be. I get up early. Okay. So. Yeah, he gets home at a good time, so. Yeah. Yeah. Hopefully, we'll be fine. We're going to film that like detailed labor and delivery video about like our whole story. Hopefully, maybe this weekend we'll do that, and then um, get that up for you guys. It's been so hard to vlog because like we're just home most of the time and we have family just like coming in and out and we're just like doing a lot of nothing. So I feel like it's not super interesting for you guys. So that's why I'm just like, right now it's just kind of like updates and stuff. I need to show you guys these though since they're just sitting right here. My aunt got me these. Well, she got Lily these. Um, these little vans. These oh are God. like the cutest thing. I have ever seen. I my cannot. Baby shoe is so cute. I know. I cannot wait till she can wear these. I have so many cute clothes for her, and I feel like, like right now, nothing fits her. She literally, I have like four, like onesies that fit her right it's now. So hot in here. Um. So into I feel like good. I can't like put her in any of my cute outfits that I had planned for her yet, to take cute pics and stuff because she's just too little, even though she's big right now. She's already eight pounds, which is crazy. And tomorrow, you get a fussy, honey? She just got scared. Oh, because the fan? Tomorrow is actually my due date, which is so crazy that she's been here for two weeks now and we haven't even reached my due date yet. But by the time you guys watch this, I'm sure it will be tomorrow or I'll post it tonight, depending on how I edit this. But um, yeah, freaking crazy. Yeah, so there's our little update. We're doing good. Baby's doing good. I'll show you in her crib more. Her crib is so cute. She doesn't have her little clothes on though. Oh, so you guys saw some clips of us taking the newborn pictures too. I am so excited to see those. I think they're gonna be the cutest things ever. And we took a Harry Potter one and I'm so freaking excited for it. Here's her little bed right now. I don't know if you guys ever saw this. It's so cute. This is from Pottery Barn, T uh, Pottery Barn, the baby one, and then this is from Pottery Barn Teen. And then we have a bumper in here, which now we know is like not something you're supposed to have in cribs anymore. So we will take it out when we actually use this crib. But you know, we just had to have it. I really don't think we're gonna be using a crib for a while, just because she's a baby, so she's gonna be in our room. And one video I do wanna film too, which let me know if you guys would be interested in this, is like newborn essentials, things that we have really loved having with a newborn and things that have helped us out or made things easier. But yeah, so I'm going to close out this vlog because I think it's time to feed my baby. My baby. My baby. So there's our update. Sorry, it's not a very long or interesting video, but that is our life right now. And um, I'll try to get those other videos out soon-ish um, when we have time to film them. Thanks for watching and we'll see you guys next week hopefully with a new video True. bye you didn't say it bye 
And my voice is <laughs> It'll be uh, so cute when Lily can say it. 